Hi everyone, welcome to Study Buddy Homeschooling. In today's session, we'll be seeing the announcement of scholarships for Indian students by Japanese government for pursuing their master's and PhD programs for the academic year 2023. All the details are available in the website embjapan.go.jp. So I'll provide the link for applying in the description of the video. So let's go into the details of the scholarship. So application guidelines are given here. We'll come through it towards the end. Let's go into the details. Type of students, research students, level, graduate level, school level. That's research, master's course or PhD course. Age should be under 35 years. These are the fields of studies in which the students can apply. Japan related humanities, Japan related social science, mathematical science, physics, chemistry, chemical engineering, Biology and Biotechnology, Agriculture and Fishery, Environmental Science, Pharmaceutical Science, Geology and Geoinformatics, Civil Engineering, Architecture, Material Science, Engineering, Electrical Engineering, Electronics and Communications Engineering, Mechanical, Aerospace Engineering. These are the subjects in which scholarship is available. So for research students, master's course, doctoral course, bachelor's degree in the relevant field with minimum 65% marks, the candidate should obtain their mark sheet and degree on or before 30th September 2023 for the October 2023 batch. So this is for the next year 2023 October, October batch. You should have your certificates ready by September 2023. For doctoral students, master's degree in the relevant field with minimum 65%. Candidates should have practical research teaching work experience after obtaining the prescribed qualification on or before 30th September 2023. You should have the similar certifications ready by 30th September to pursue for the academic year October 2023. For non-regular students, the scholarship will, period will start from April, September or October 2023 until the end of March 2025. This is for the non-regular students. For regular students, regardless of the date of arrival, scholarship period shall be necessary period of completion of regular reg uh, course, your respective regular course. Number of scholarships to be announced. Stipend is students who are in the preparatory education or non-regular students, they get, get about 85,800 rupees per month and uh, regular students for masters or professional course they get about 86,400 per month and regular students enrolled in PhD programs doctoral courses are, are uh, eligible to get about 87,000 per month education fees is exempted and traveling expenses round trip airfare will be provided how to apply for the scholarship the document screening will be conducted based on the following preliminary application form. If you wish to apply, please email this form by 15th May. So, uh, very little time is available, hardly two weeks available to apply for the scholarship. So, uh, make sure you go and fill the form as soon as possible, those who are interested. This is the preliminary application form link. If you click in there, you will go into the page and uh, the details are available here. This is the application format. You have to fill the same to apply for the scholarship. All your personal details are asked and then and now th this has to be filled up and sent to this email ID scholarship india at nd.mfa.go.jp application received after the aforesaid date and time will be automatically rejected. Also the files in other formats such as scanned copies of handwritten documents PDF PowerPoint, Google Drive, link to Google Docs, etc. will also be rejected automatically. No supporting documents are required to be submitted with the preliminary application form. So you don't have to submit any preliminary application form all um, along with the uh, preliminary application form. All you have to do is take the printout of this and um, fill it up, uh, scan it and send it. Handwritten copies are not encouraged. So, schedule of the preliminary selection, application deadline is 15th May, application screening from May to June 2022, notification of the result is third week of June, written examination by 25th June, online interview around the end of June 2022. So, let's go into the preliminary, you have these guidelines here, you can click here to see the guidelines. So these are the guidelines given to 
apply for the scholarships detailed guidelines are given like definition of research students field of study qualification and conditions and they have several categories like doctoral course japanese language health arrival in japan visa requirement non eligibility so all the details are available period of scholarship extended period of scholarship scholarship benefits all the details are provided here all you have to do is go into the link and apply for the scholarship it's completely funded by japanese government so please do apply as soon as possible remember that last date is may 15th 2020 for the next academic year which is going to start in october 2023 in japan all the very best thanks for watching study body homeschooling please do subscribe like and share the video thank you